up to Mourinho, also standing up to the challenge. He's always been a solid player, but just seemed to be out there as one of the guys. This past weekend, he seemed to be wearing the leader's mantle, and if he can do it again, still in the box as we are underway. It's Pinto in goal, Alves, Piquet, Puyol, and Abidal with Busquets, Xavi, and Iniesta in the midfield, and again on the break. This time it's Higuain, but he sends it wide. Talk about releasing the hounds. Look at this, a bad back pass here, and Piquet freezes, and Higuain should have done better. It's very sloppy by Piquet. Piquet should have been ushering it away back towards the... Yeah. Launched inside, ah! missed on the header by Ramos and Higuain denied by Pinto. Fabulous save by Pinto and a beautiful ball played in right on the button from Alonso. It's flighted in heavenly over the top of the defence and then it dips down beyond them. Beautiful ball that is attacked, they're onside all right. Higuain just standing there behind, looks like Dani Alves when the ball gets flighted in. Still looks on site to me, the and ball. this one gets called back, but Pinto is up. Ninth meeting all time, including friendlies between these oh. two rivals. Ball sliding in. Was it to the path? The shot to the near post from Ronaldo did not miss by much. It took a miracle to get behind and around this ball, but it's lovely engineering again from the Royal Whites of Real Madrid, who are knitting their stuff together nicely, led by Avatar Eyes. Maybe Cristiano... I've, uh, Mesut Ozil was expecting that one to be played back to him first time. He took a hell of an attempt, but... Pika fights through the challenge of Piquet. Play three on three, four on three if they hurry. Goes to the near side, Ronaldo on his left. Ronaldo deflected, and this time Pinto stones him. Back for Kaká, poked free, and now Piquet a lunge to put it out of... Keep one out of his hand, he ignores Higuain and Otzil, and he goes for the Portuguese man who pummels this one directly with as much venom as he can, and this time, as you said, Phil Sheen, Pinto is up to it. Intra-provincial showdown. Here a chance Magic. as Cesc has two to his right. Oh. Messi has to stop and can't get back to Alexis. A poor ball by Fabregas. He sets himself up beautifully, but it's an inconsiderate pass to Messi. It's behind Leo, and it should have been played a little earlier from Cesc, and he knows it. It was a beautiful opportunity, and the first one, really, for Barcelona. Leo tries to curl it. But he's asking too much. A long ball. What a will pass. find Cristiano Ronaldo. Magnificent from Austin. Around Alves, not once but twice. Into oh. the middle and knocked wide for the corner from Puyol. And Higuain was waiting on that back post head. Cristiano being able to see him. But look at this little delightful, artful dodger. Wonderful vision from Avatar Eyes. Perfect strike into Cristiano. And then. He's looking for that back post there. He sees the vulture waiting in the big Argentina man. Dangerous. Alonso near post. Glancing header from the Brazilian turned Portuguese man. Off the gut of Busquets and out for another corner. Typical of Mourinho damning his critics and all the expectations that Pepe would be kept out of this lion's den after what happened with the stomp. Sergi on the arm, but the arm is took in to his body, perhaps. He's on side. And here, was this a handball against Busquets? Coming football again from the Whites. Out of the lower, making a run forward. Back for Magic. the tiny German, rifles it back, post! Ah! Off woodwork and bounces clear. Back in from Higuain and grabbed by Pinto. This one like is a why they call friend. him Avatar Eyes all the time. The magnificent German Mesut, Mesut, Mesut. Absolutely spellbinding. Magisterial strike from to put in his little belly dancer steps and his little touch passes. He detonates this one. And it is so close. Magnificent technique. And as I said, good Man start. down, quickly That's restarted. Magic. Chance for Mesut Ozil and played back by Against Abidal. anybody else other than Eric Abidal. Oh, give away. 
A chance for Higuain. Kick save by Pinto, putting out his own fire. Another opportunity for Real Madrid. Didn't see anything there, but here Pinto doesn't quite get his passing right, but he gets his legs right and shuts down Higuain. Maybe Alexis went Look in the middle. behind Sergio Ramos there. Messi drives. Left to open. Messi through. Magic! Pedro, goal! Goal! Messi! just drives the ship into port and Pedro lays one in it's Barcelona in front oh cut apart from the genius of Messi again he draws the defense to him like a magnet and once more Casillas's men are playing poker with a witch they're gonna lose Messi magisterial Pedro, that man, I told you about people. He's a goal scorer and he's a real talent. Holds up beautifully and what a dispatch. Fabulous by Messi. Magic feet, dripping honey on it with every touch. And then he's got the awareness, the dexterity and that X-ray vision like Superman through steel to put it on an absolute golden altar. Again, from this angle. Again, the gazelle running around cheetahs, but look at that pass, people. It's absolutely monumentally perfect, and the finish is everything that that man doesn't want to see. Not quite sure what other, and that's what showed you up there tonight. And again, this is tilted the... Oh, it's going to be a card, this. He's already got one. Got to be a card. And you can see Casillas screaming at him. Uh, if he doesn't get a card for this, people, then believe me, this isn't bias at all. Because Real Madrid have been playing fabulously well, and Barcelona cannot believe because Messi drives past Las Diera and absolutely does him up like a kipper, and Las just comes across and takes his leg. And it's got to be. We haven't seen the replay either yet. We're seeing exactly what you people are seeing. So we'll just wait and find out. The yellow against Casillas for coming out of the area. And Take he might have done again. that on he purpose. He goes past him and he comes and he absolutely blades through him. He steps across the ball into Leo. And that's a completely foreseen foul on the player. Absolutely completely from a man who... Uh, Really enjoy watching last year, but again, this is civil war here that we're seeing Spanish against Spanish. The Spanish World Cup captain coming out and protecting last year, but come on, yeah, if it had been any other player into the wall other than Diera. Messi, driven by Alves, top shelf, two nothing Barca, a half dominated by Real Madrid but the tail firmly between their legs as they head to the dressing room at the half. Does it the Brazilian way, which is nothing less than perfection. And Dani Alves says, look at this, Kaká. Look at this. He absolutely flamed through as this in its top corner. If Casillas is stretching out his arm to this and gets a hand to it, he would have had it taken off. Look at the technique again. He takes the spin of the ball into account. He takes the planets in the solar system into account as well. That is an impossible strike. Made easy from Dani Alves for the second one and a big, big nail in what looks to be Real Madrid's coffin. They need three goals in the second half to advance. It's Barcelona 2, Madrid 1, 4-1 oh. on aggregate, oh. absolutely stunning at the half. The players on the pitch were millimeter perfect. They needed to be even closer though, and bottom men in the wall. Casillas nervously in the center of his line, lifted up and over. And it was Xavi who ended up sneaking that one through.
just one. But now the tables turn. Alonso slips as he drives. Headed home by Ramos. Pinto couldn't get there. Huh? But no, they're going to wave it off. It's what is their contact? It's going to be cards given out either way here. Well, we haven't seen any replays either, people. It looked like a fair goal to me. Oh, there's that little pull on Danny Alves. He take a look again. Sergio Ramos gets him, and I'm not so sure if it's enough to pull him down, but why do it? Now, uh, you see there, he definitely grabs both. He gets both hands on Danny Alves, and he goes down. And what are you doing, Sergio? I'm not so sure that he really needed to do that. Granado for nice Arbaloa, back for Granado on the volley. Not a bad idea, but off target. Yeah, really, why not? Nothing else in the lead-up has worked, so why not be speculative and brave? And that's what Granero is, and it's just a leap. Three goals in 23 minutes. Will this be the first? Yes! Ronaldo on the board. The first bite is taken. And can Madrid keep the comeback going? Well, that's lit the blue to touch paper for sure and gives them a real good set of hope here. And who else is it? I'll give you 15 guesses and your first 15 don't count. Mesut Ozil takes it in stride beautifully, doesn't even look for the pass, knows instinctively because he's taken half a dozen pictures in his wonderful computer mind before he receives the ball. He could have four goals in the opening dozen minutes, and that doesn't even count. Zin Puzzles shot the blasted off the bar. Benzema passed Puyol, ah! and he does. He slides in on the volley and puts in goal number two, and now Madrid is just one goal away. Is that magnificent directness that I was warning about? It is very simple, and he could sense it coming through in the substitutes. So we're seeing that Benzema and Cristiano had the pace over the top. It's sent in right off the head of Callejon, and that's wonderful coolness under pressure and grace. Nice little stab ball over the top. Beautiful little freak from Benz, and a nice finish. Took a weird, nicely passed Pinto. Wow. And a round point. Possession's been very, very sketchy. Xavi took one earlier. This looks like it's all messy. Pedro getting into a battle with Benzema. Messi, oh. 23, just over the crossbar. Just didn't die at the most pivotal time. Just doesn't die enough. Not a bad effort, but to see us close enough had it been dropping in towards the net. He got probably, well, who knows, the killer. Nice little back heel, starts another break. Real stretched, Messi shoots, near post but the wrong side of the pipe. Dani Alves going to the right of him, gives him an option, he's got another one on the left side of him, but he goes for goal, and who can blame him? Just pulls it a little bit away this time on the run. Knocked down, far side, looking, Alves looking, looking, chips to the middle, Pedro oh. diving header. And he had Messi behind. Well, he had his chest as well. He could have taken it down the player. And that looked as if that was a half a stamp as well. Take a look and tell me. Looked like he was aiming if it was there. Just the one amazing thing is we've gone 92 minutes. That is it. Time runs out. Madrid's comeback is over and the champion has been defeated. They come back to a two-all draw, but not enough. Credible bravery by Real Madrid, and Real Madrid constantly bellyaching about the referee, but they should look in the mirror a little bit more.